Hello and welcome back to the FTB Spots. Today we're going over two pieces of equipment getting ready to make the solar panels. The first one is the Industrial Craft Compressor. This is used for a number of, of things, just a few actually. And first of all, I'm going to show you how to build it. The compressor is built with a machine block, smooth stone, and a circuit. Not a very confusing recipe. Again, you got a circuit and a machine block, two component items from Industrial Craft. Now, what we use a compressor for, number one, if you compress a snowball, you can make ice. I'll let that run through there. Uh, there's a few things you can do. You can comp compress plant balls. It's used to make biofuel. And the main thing that you're going to end up using your compressor for is making carbon plates. To make a carbon plate, you need to first make this raw carbon mesh, which I will show you how to do that. As you can see, we got the ice block from the, the snowball. And you compress the raw carbon mesh, and that will make you an iron plate. To make the raw carbon mesh, you first need to make a bit of coal dust. You do that by running a piece of coal through the macerator right there, which we already went over in the last one. That'll turn it into coal dust. And... Uh, to make the mesh, take your coal dust, actually you can do it in your regular crafting window too, and just make a block of four, that will give you raw fiber. Make four more, will give you another raw carbon fiber, and two of these in any position will give you your carbon mesh. Run that through the compressor and you get yourself a carbon plate. You'll be needing quite a few of these carbon plates, so do mine your coal. Um, that's mainly all what you're going to use the compressor for, so we will then head on to the next item we need, we'll need. we be needing for our solar panel, and that is going to be this funny looking one. It's actually from Railcraft. It's called the Rolling Machine. It does run off the Buildcraft power, which is why I have it over on this half, and I'm able to connect it. I, I've added a few pieces of equipment over here, um, doing some other stuff, but I was had it hooked up to uh, the, the Buildcraft pipe over there for the power. Now what we're doing here, uh, so first of all I want to show you why we need this. I'm going to need a little bit of copper, uh, two, three, one, two, I need nine of those, and I'm going to need also some tin. We need to make some bronze. To make bronze you put in, well, one tin to three copper and it will give you bronze blend. So I'm going to put, I need three of these. Well, actually, no, I don't need three, do I? Because I have this handy-dandy little induction smelter that's going to give me two for each one. There we go. I need three bars, which we're going to lay in there. We're going to put the tin in there, and then where is my refined iron? And this will give you a mixed metal ingot. Now, you used to be able to make these mixed metal ingots on a regular crafting table, but that's not going to work anymore. You actually have to run it through this rolling machine. So you put the recipe in there, and then you click on this once, and that'll start it. It's going to suck down your power, and it should be enough to, yes, just barely enough to make two mixed metal ingots. Run these into your compressor, and it's going to give you an advanced alloy, which is one thing that you need coming up. And we'll be needing this in the next video. So do get these set up if you haven't yet. And uh, in the next very next video, we're going to be making an industrial centrifuge, which is also needed for the solar panels. That Greg Tech sure has made them a lot more complicated. So you see these mixed metal ingots will make you your advanced alloy. And you're going to be using a lot of advanced alloy, just like you're going to be using a lot of carbon, carbon plates. So do set up some way you can make these rather easily. To make the um, the rolling machine, let's run that through um, NEI right here. It's actually four pistons, four iron ingots, and a crafting table. So not a lot of advanced stuff, just a lot of uh, a lot of materials depending on your whether you're just starting in the game or not. This is this is eight pieces of iron to make it. Each piston has one piece of iron. That's why I say eight. And a crafting table. So you can whip one of those up not 
too difficult if you have a decent start into Minecraft. So do get those, and the next video we will go into this little guy, Industrial Centrifuge. I'll show you how to make it, how to use it. And, uh, oh, one other thing, this compressor, uh, excuse me, macerator. I think I showed you that, right? Yeah, I did. You can macerate the gravel and turn it into flint. And I mention that again because I'm going to be using a lot of flint to, uh, to make these uh, solar panels. So, do come back next time for the next video about the industrial craft centrifuge or the greg tech excuse me the greg tech that's what that g is centrifuge and then after that we'll get into how to make the solar panels and uh this right here i'll also have to talk about why i'm doing that with the mfe so do like and subscribe if you want to see more of these videos subscribe so you don't miss any because we are going to go through a couple things rather quickly thank you all for watching